Hi, this is Norm from Regency Design and Build. This is a basement job that we did and uh, everything was from scratch. There was just cinder block here, uh, just cinder block walls. And when we put this design together, we had a few questions as to whether we should have the refrigerator over here or the refrigerator in the corner. So the nice thing is, is to have a team of designers, which we do have, um, and we were, we were able to lay out this uh, plan for them relatively quickly. And so we were able to show them on a 3D mock-up as to which way they would like it better. So they ended up doing it over here. They're very happy with it. it worked out great. Now, the important thing is to really, really know what you're going to want to do with this kitchen. And being that it's a basement and it's for their rec room, which we'll, we'll look at it soon, um, is to look at things like whether you want a uh, wine and beer cooler. And, uh, and if you do, you really know, you need to know ahead of time because if you don't do this ahead of time, you're not going to have electrical behind it. That's very important. And in, in this feature over here, they really wanted to have an area where they could watch TV here too as well, because there's a table here. I don't think you can see it, but you know, in case they're just down here relaxing, they're not on the big screen, and they like this idea of having the TV here as well. We have the microwave here, we got the, the wine racks, and basically everything they needed is here, and they're very happy with it. So uh, let's go further. Um, just to give you an idea on the stairs, this was an all this this was a totally open stair system when we came here. And what I recommend to you is always to really kind of see what you like. They um, they they really did their research and they 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 found this very unique. A spindle which has a router around it on the top and the bottom and they just loved it and uh, of course once they uh, made the decision we built it for them. So like I said this is all from scratch and uh, this is the opening area over here. If you look at the carpet on the steps we've spoken about it before there's two ways to install the carpet one way is a waterfall this is the way uh, we like to do it because it it's it just looks nicer it's called Hollywood and just by the representation of the name, it sounds more fancy, but it really represents the step a lot better. It looks nice, and we like it. Okay, over here, we have a knee wall that we built that's a little bit higher than normal. Um, they wanted to create a separation between their rooms. So we have the kitchen area behind me. We have the rec room in front of us where you have the TVs. But something that we do, which is very unique, is that we use a concealed system here to support the, the granite. A lot of people use corbels, and what happens, you have four chairs over here, you would need four or five corbels, and you'd be hitting your knees on them all the time, very uncomfortable. So we use a concealed steel system. You don't see it, just like by the name, it's concealed. And you have this nice big slab and it works out great. So now we're into the rec room area here where we have that separation. Maybe you can get a shot over here from maybe the kitchen. Kind of separate the, the rec room here. Kind of see how they separated the room, which is kind of nice. <clears throat> um, so like I said before, if, you, if we look down this uh, long area over here, this was all bare cinder block. There was nothing here before. Um, and they uh, tried to use every bit of space, like they put a nice uh, shuffleboard game here. Got a few other games here for the children, another TV. As we come down here, we had this discussion about, you know, it could be at times they're going to have a lot of people here. So it was going back and forth about building an egress window, which this was, of course, not here. It was just like one of those windows over there. So we got our mason guy out, enlarged this whole area, supported it properly, put this large window over here with the window well, 
good to go. So if you ever have a situation, you have an easy way to get out. This is important in case you have a lot of people, let's say they're having a Super Bowl party tonight, right? And it's 25, 30 people and God forbid something happens and they got to get out in a hurry. Well, there you go. You can get out. The window well has built in steps, it has a top on it, which keeps all the, the snow and the rain out. It easily pops off. And uh, there, you, there you have it. In case there's any uh, situations you have to get out immediately. Typically you only need egress windows if it's a living space area. In this case, it's a fun place area. So it was just an extra precaution. So over here, um, we had this extra space here. The wife really wanted some bookshelves. And so we just, we built these from scratch and uh, there was too much space on the top. So we came up with the idea of putting a balance. She loved it and that finished this area off. <clears throat> and then over here, um, we have a, a basic bathroom. It's uh, nice, very simple. They wanted to put most of their money into the main area. So we could do this as well. We got a nice vanity. You have a good toilet, you have a shower. This is Norm from Regency Design and Build, creating beautiful spaces for exceptional living. Have yourself a good one.